Hey what's up everybody this is Dom and we are checking out the Samsung Gear Fit and comparing it to the Samsung Gear 2 or Gear 2 Neo. This is a fitness band but it provides a lot more functionality than most fitness bands on the market. It will give you instant notifications from compatible Galaxy smartphones like incoming calls, emails, SMS, alarm, S planner and other third party apps. It's not going to provide you with the same extended functionality that you'll find on the Gear 2 or Gear 2 Neo so I tend to think of this as the Gear 2 to light almost but you do have things like the heart rate sensor that's built into the bottom side of the band so it always makes contact with your skin and you can check your heart rate at any moment jumping into specifications we have a crisp 1.84 inch curved super AMOLED display with a resolution of 432 by 128 and 244 pixels per inch the gear fit also does feature changeable straps IP67 dust and water resistance Bluetooth 4.0 and accelerometer gyroscope and heart rate meter like I mentioned earlier earlier and a 210 milliamp hour battery with a typical usage of three to four days and a low usage of up to five days. So here's a quick example of the notifications feature found on the Gear Fit. As you can see it will pop up on the screen and you can go ahead and tap to dismiss the notification or you can go into your notifications folder and address it. We have the ability to read the message, the date and time and we can also swipe up for other options like quick reply, show on device and delete. The Gear Fit's body is more compact than the Gear 2 or Gear 2 to Neo, but it does feel a little bit bulkier just because of the curved display and I felt like it stuck out a little more on my wrist. Now when comparing features, if you own a Gear 2 or Gear 2 Neo, you're not going to need a Gear Fit unless you like that slimmer form factor, but keep in mind you're not going to get all of the same features on the Gear Fit that you get on the Gear 2 or Gear 2 Neo. So there's definitely a compromise there if you want something smaller or just something for fitness related purposes, but overall I think that the Gear Fit is a well-rounded device. So I hope you enjoyed this brief overview of the Gear Fit and comparison to the Gear 2 and Gear 2 Neo. And if you did, be sure to hit that thumbs up button as it does help out the channel a lot. Also, subscribe for more content like this in the future. And if you'd like to check out any of my other videos that I covered at the NYC event for Samsung, be sure to check the links down in the description. Thanks again for watching, everybody. I really appreciate it. This is Dom, and have a great day.